Okay, suddenly we have, before we only had one person for Trump. Now, then we had two, and now it looks like we have maybe the seven. It's growing. It's growing. Yes, it is. Uh huh. What's yes, your name? Yes, it is. Uh, Kira Ennis. So they're walking around with uh, a Trump as a racist poster. Lies. Lies. That's a bunch of lies. Trumped up by the Clinton News Network. So, why, why was there such a, 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 a weak showing of Trump supporters here tonight? Well, this Today. is not our event. This is not our event. They just came here to kind of support. They found that some people were being, you know, harassed, who just happened to kind of show up, not even trying to be here for the event, just happened to show up. You know, I mean, this is a public area. And they said, okay, well, our people need reinforcements. Let's go there and show that we support them. And that's kind of what happened. Me, personally, I was out at the Border Wall rally in San Diego. In San Diego today? Yes. And when my, my party and I, we came here um, to try to, you know, take in some Beverly Hills scenery before we go to the valley, catch a bite to eat, you know, and we happened to come across what we thought originally was a Trump uh, rally. We didn't see what the sign said. I saw a big American flag, so I assumed, okay, my people, you know, so we walk, we were walking through this way to get to our, you know, our meal, and we see it's not a Trump-friendly environment. No, no, no. And we kind of got caught in the fray here, uh -huh. and that's what we're here. How many people were down there in San Diego today? Oh, so many. Hundreds. Hundreds. Hundreds of them. Were were there, were there anti-Trump protesters too? Uh, they, if there were, they weren't near us. They kept us separate. They, oh, there, uh-huh. Because the, course, the other side does not know how to behave themselves, so. Uh-huh. Uh, in, in what way? What, are they, what, what would they do if you guys got close? Look at this. I mean, you have people shouting people down, cussing and screaming at them. One lady, one black lady in a pussy hat was literally yelling and shouting at me continuously in a mind-numbing, monotone voice for about an hour. And I'm like, what is this chick's beef? What is her deal with me? You know, it was a little bit, uh, it was kind of funny. If, if, if it wasn't such a showing of her clear mental instability. Uh-huh. Do you think that she's ever had a, a conversation, a discussion on, on these not. issues? No. All they do is chant. They All they chant? do is chant, cuss, and shout you down. And when you don't let them, when you meet their anger with facts, uh -huh. when you meet their emotional-driven hyperbole with the truth, uh -huh. articulately executed, yeah. Yeah. they run away. Because they do not want to have a conversation. They do not want to have a dialogue. What they want to have is a shouting match. They think whoever is the loudest wins. It's not always, in fact, it's never the case. But are they intimidating uh, Trump supporters from no. coming out? One thing Trump supporters are not are easily scared. We are very much true grit. We're tough as nails. We do not scare easily. You think if we did, we'd wear these hats, we'd fly these flags. We don't give a flying fig. Who doesn't like our views? We have the right to speak them. If someone doesn't like it, well, you can go cry in your, in your, in your safe space. This is the truth, pure and simple. Not to be blunt, the facts are the facts.